Alrighty here. So we got my man, Emmanuel uh, Navarrete versus Oscar Valdez. Man, what an amazing performance that was put on. This right here is also fight of the year. Okay. I mean, my goodness, ESPN. Damn, gave us a free fight. All right. Now, this right here would have been pay-per-view worthy. These two, Emmanuel Navarrete and, uh, you know, Oscar Valdez. Yeah, that's pay-per-view, you know, worthy. You know what I'm saying? They, they both are some, you know, pretty strong warriors. Um, You know, they were dropping bombs on each other. They were, you know, you know uh, knockdowns because the boys can take a punch. OK, Um, it looked like something that was close to a knockdown, but it was, you know, mostly a push and a slip. But. Man, the oohs and ahs, you know, and watching these dudes just stand there and eat each other's punches. And by the way, did y'all see, uh, you know, Oscar Valdez's face at the end? See how swollen bulge? You know, I wonder if the fans going to say he should retire. Or are they going to say Emmanuel Navarrete has something in his gloves? Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah. Nah, hey, it was a fair fight. You know what I mean? And y'all know who I was hinting at. Okay. Now. I would say the uh, Showtime card with uh, Crawford and Spence will be candidate a fight of the year, but that wasn't a fight. That was not a fight. Okay, yeah, that was a one-sided behind whooping. So I don't know this. What we seen tonight, this was a fight. All right, now talking about um, going back with Emmanuel Navarrete, talking about him. Where can he go from here? Can, do you think Emmanuel Navarrete could be a four division champion? You know, think he can move up to 135? I think so. You know, I think he's good enough and, you know, strong enough, big enough to hang with the guys at 135 and become, uh, you know, a four division champion. OK, um, I don't know how many Mexican fighters that done it. Um, they said it was only nine that became uh, three divisions. So uh, if. You know, Emmanuel Navarrete would be. Oh, wait, I'm wrong. Shoot. Canelo Alvarez. OK, yeah. Canelo Alvarez have, have won in multiple divisions. Right. So um, I think what? 154, 160 and 168. And yeah, Canelo Alvarez. So I, I, I take that back, you know, but Emmanuel Navarrete, you know, he could, you know, follow right behind Canelo and uh, win in more divisions. But, you know, Emmanuel Navarrete who's always ready is taking on some stiff competition. Okay. Especially if he moves up to, you know, uh, 135. Um, I don't think, uh, Javante Davis is going anywhere any, anytime soon. You know what I'm saying? Not unless never ready to move up there. And if he go, if he goes up there, eesh, my goodness, you know, I'm, I'm yo, he better make that move. Okay. And go uh, take on Antoine, uh, Gary Antoine Russell. All right. But then again, who knows? I, it, that'd be another good fight. You know, so anyways, man, what another great night of boxing. I enjoyed it all. The Mexican Warriors, Emmanuel Navarrete versus um, Oscar Valdez. Yeah, we got to see more of this. So that's my take on this CMD boxing reports. And I catch you guys on the next one.